family of brothers arrested on Friday night file complaint following the death of older sibling. A drug suppression military unit in Nakhon Panom province arrested two brothers last Friday night. The family were told later that the older brother was being treated in hospital where they later found him dead. Police are investigating a complaint filed by the family claiming that the duo was tortured. 33-year-old Yadhana Saisa appeared to have been badly beaten while his brother 29-year-old Natha Bangse Asa was later found at a military operations center at a temple, also badly beaten. The top brass of Thailand's Second Army in northeastern Thailand are reaching out to a family after two brothers are reported to have been physically abused after being taken into custody by a drug suppression unit on Friday evening last. One of the men died from his injuries while another is being treated at a local hospital in the That Panom district of Nakhon Panom province. It is understood that the commanding officer of the unit has instigated a panel to investigate the incident while police at That Panom have expedited a criminal investigation against 11 military personnel linked to the matter which the family of the men has labeled as torture. Police in Nakhon Panom in northern Thailand are expected to file charges against 11 Thai soldiers implicated after two men both brothers and suspected of involvement in the illegal drug trade, were detained on Friday. Both were badly beaten at an army operations center located at a temple in Tamban Fangdaang in the Thet Panom district of the province on the border with Laos. One brother, 33-year-old Yudhana Saisa, was found dead by his relatives after they received a tip-off to visit the local Thet Panom Crown Prince Hospital later on Friday night. Arrested on Friday evening by drug suppression unit linked with the 2nd Thai Army in Nakhon Panom. Both brothers had been earlier arrested by the military unit which identified itself as an anti-drug suppression unit of Thailand's 2nd Army. The men were taken into custody at the family's home in Banyang Kham in Tam Nam Al located in the That Panom district in the southeast of the border province. Parents say deceased man, found at the local hospital, looked like he had been badly beaten. The parents of the two men, 59-year-old Niwat Saisa and his 56-year-old wife Pan, say that from the appearance of the deceased man, it looked like he had been badly beaten. They later found their younger son, 29-year-old Nathapung Saisa, at a military operations center in the Fangdaang district and had him removed to the same hospital where his brother was found dead. Police in that Panom expediting the case. Police in that Panom are reported to be expediting the preparation of a criminal case against 11 soldiers including one commanding officer, six non-commissioned officers and four conscripts following an expedited investigation. They are currently awaiting the results of a post-mortem on the body of the 33-year-old older brother. His body was sent to the Forensic Medicine Institute in Konkane for an autopsy. Police are also awaiting a medical report from the hospital on the injuries sustained by the deceased man and his younger brother. Police awaiting an autopsy and medical report to file charges against 11 military personnel. Police Colonel Srinikor Nyawat, the Thet Panom police chief, said on Tuesday that investigators had been trying to expedite the gathering of evidence and file charges against those responsible. The police investigation followed the formal complaint by the parents of both men to Thet Panom police on Sunday evening. Police Colonel Srinikorn has confirmed that the investigation is moving ahead and as a matter of priority. 10,000 paid to the family by a drug suppression center as offers made to pay for the funeral. A drug prevention and suppression center in Thailand's northeast has contacted the family and given 10,000 to assist them at this time. It is also reported that officers with the Shurasak Montri task force have been sent to assist the family with funeral arrangements for the deceased man. It follows offers from the army to compensate the family in addition to paying for the funeral of the older brother. Commanding officer has spoken to the men's father. Reports suggest that the commanding officer of the military unit involved has spoken with Mr. Nasat and assured him that a military panel has also been set up to investigate what happened on Friday night. Younger man being treated for two broken ribs and extensive bruising throughout his body. That investigation is also awaiting the autopsy results and a medical report from the Thet Panom Crown Prince Hospital on both brothers. Initial reports suggest that doctors have confirmed that the young man, 29-year-old Mr. Nathapong, is being treated for two broken ribs and extensive bruising throughout his body. The family are claiming that the men were tortured by the military unit after being taken into custody. Further reading. Evil drugs trade in Chong Klasi's Thai woman burned alive by her family for 300 grams of ice missing in village. One of the biggest drug dealers in the South flees home as Thai police and army move against him.
Thai police arrest Army Lieutenant in Buriram Province for Christmas Eve armed bank robbery of 1 million. Thailand at war with drugs as regional anti-drug effort gains steam, foreigners must not be the enemy. New Yaba production recipe behind drug shipments across Thailand as the kingdom fights a lethal war.